uh, a bit of a regular event for the last few months. It's the third opening that we've now done for uh, attractions that are joint ventures with the Science Museum. Now we have this uh, new uh, typhoon simulation experience and the centerpiece of it is a film uh, which we shot with the RAF Typhoon Force um, out of RAF Coningsby earlier in the summer. I would like to say thank you especially to the two pilots who flew the mission, Graham Pevington and David Norris. Since the simulator opened in July, um, from the figures that I've seen, um, the number of people who been through it, and the reports that we've had, um, it's really been very well received. It's a, it's a spectacular uh, addition to this, uh, this gallery. Very brief, I'd like to thank Paul, Jude, Steve and the Metropolis team. Uh, we have a, a long-standing partnership with them uh, and will do for, for many years to come. Uh, for those of you that are from the museum sector, it's a very profitable partnership as well, uh, which really helps from a museum point of view. <laughs> I'd like to thank the, the RAF guys who have done, and thank you for going out of your way for making such a, an exceptional film for us, because I think it's absolutely fabulous. And if you could take our thanks back as well to the guys back at, back at base and say that they've, they've been brilliant and hugely helpful. Uh, and hopefully it, it's part and, and of an ongoing relationship as well between the Science Museum and the RAF and something that we can develop into the future. When I saw the film I was, I was very, very impressed. It is an amazing film and gives you a real feel for the experience of being in the back seat of a typhoon. And one of the, the issues always for museums is we have an awful lot of uh, rockets, a huge flight gallery through there, but it's very hard to recreate that experience for our, for our visitors but it does give you a sense of what it's like. So when they go through and through see our uh, exhibits in the galleries, they get an idea about what it's all about. It's my huge privilege to be OC uh, Office Commanding 29 Squadron, which is the, uh, the squadron that flies the, the Typhoons on the, in the training role. We were uh, going flying and our normal business was happening with a busy flight line. And it was a huge opportunity here, a really good opportunity to get Metropolis involved in the back seat of a training sortie to uh, engage with the science museum and really well engage with the public but in particular children and those who are looking into science and the sort of uh, inspirational development of science within the UK to have a little insight into the world that we live in. It's, a, it's great for all efforts because it does hopefully inspire young children, it does inspire all sorts of generations and it gives us as Royal Air Force an opportunity as a springboard to talk about what we do and hopefully engage with the taxpayers and, uh, and explain why we spend money on the, on the Royal Air Force, uh, not just doing air displays and not just cruising around the world, but actually trying to do some core rocks. And we see that day in day in the UK over uh, the airspace protecting the UK, deploying overseas, supporting uh, land forces, be them our own land forces or other land forces. And this is a, a great opportunity, as I say, a little insight into that world. Thank you.